Hello on this uh, second uh, part on this uh, series on what's new in Moodle 3.10. So today we're going to talk about deep linking multiple. So it's a small feature, but it's a feature that's been long been awaited for. And so let's see what it is about. So here I'm going to pick a tool here, again, the same test tool. Um, so we see here that um, it has support deep linking enabled. And that's very important, support deep linking. Deep linking is a link to create links. And really, uh, in modern LTI, you should not use uh, any manual creation of links. Users should always use deep linking to import links into their course. So here we've enabled uh, support deep linking in, this, in that tool. And so now let's see it uh, working as an, uh, as an instructor. So, so we're going to pick a course and we're going to turn anything on and we're going to import a link uh, through deep linking. So let's see what actually changed there. So you see, I'm going to pick Robotest. And because Robotest allows deep linking, then I can select content. And again, I don't want to have the user to fill that form. So it's just going to select content and bring my content here. So I'm just going to turn on here, inspect element, so that we see what's actually being passed. So I'm going to select content here. And so you see already this one says is a little happy here. It says your platform supports multiple items to be returned. And yes, these features are all about the ability to return more than one item at a time. So we're going to capture into the um, network the actual ID token value. So we just grab everything here to the, and then we're going to paste it here. So uh, to see the actual content of what's being sent uh, from Moodle and somewhere here we're going to find the claims that contains information about deep linking settings capabilities. Here it is. And so we see that Moodle has now says, okay, we support deep linking settings. The only thing you can bring me back are a TI resource link. And more importantly, now Moodle says, I accept multiple items to be returned at a time. That's a big change. So what does that mean now? So that means here in your tool, you can just don't have to bring one link at a time and after another link and after another link and do that multiple times you can say bring me multiple and here i'm going to bring this graded link and the not grading link and I'm both of them at the same time and here we are and you see that now moodle because it's have actually more than one link will not show you any link settings it just tell you those are settings that are going to be imported and one is graded and tell you how much points and so therefore a gradebook column will be also created after import and this one is not graded, so there will be no gradebook colon. I can save and return to course. And now I have my two uh, links that have just been added here.